Hello there, you goofy gobbers, you gobbling buffoons. Here's five things I don't like about Pavlov Shag. Number five. When you shoot a gun in Pavlov Shag, the bullets don't actually leave the mag. I'm counting six right now. Um, that still looks like six to me. But now there's none. Mm, I don't know, man. This seems quite stupid. Number 15. I've never gotten the psychopath role. If you've played Pavlov Shack on TDT, you've probably seen someone have a little purple guy above their head, but they get instantly pow pow pow'd. I've never actually gotten it. This is so infuriating. Number 3. The mischievous box from the hit video from the hit youtuber Small Black Steam. This box shows great resistance from being closed on multiple occasions. I just don't understand how it wouldn't close. Number yeah, hmm. Dave Ills, hit known for being the hit developer of the hit game Pavlov VR. Pavlov Shack and the one for PSVR. He on very many occasions has said update coming soon, but update never came. This makes me really really angry. Gah. Number two. Yesterday TikTok asked for access to control the entirety of the internet network. And when I was falling asleep, I heard someone whisper in my ear. I think the Chinese government is living in my walls. Now, here's a guest appearance from my friend, Mr. The. And here's one thing me, Zaku Dragoon, does not like about Pavlov Shag. When I'm playing Pavlov Shag and something shoots me in the foot and I take all the damage and I shoot them in the forehead and they don't die and I'm playing Pavlov Shack. Pavlov Shack is a buggy game of Easter egg, Easter egg right there and people don't listen to me with Pavlov Shack. <laughs>